Hello friends. I wanted to talk about semen retention and attraction. So this is a pretty common thing that people are noticing is once you start practicing semen retention, people, especially the opposite sex, but just people in general, start to become very attracted to you. You become very magnetic to those around you. And this is, becomes especially obvious if you're used to ejaculating constantly, you know, just draining your life force constantly, what you will, you will start to notice a huge difference in your interactions with others once you have been retaining your semen for a little while. And so there's many reasons for this. Uh, what happens when you start retaining semen is as, as a man, our uh, hormonal production, well, just our home hormone levels in general are greatly increased because when you're every time you ejaculate you're losing a lot of these hormones uh, a lot of vitamins and minerals that are in the semen the semen is essentially the essence of ourselves the essence of our bodies the body puts all of its you know it puts a lot of resources into creating sperm because it's you know as as a biological process it's for the the propagation of the species you know reproduction so obviously this is an important thing for our species, which is why the body places great emphasis on creating sperm. So when you're constantly ejaculating your, uh, your life force, you're losing a lot of these resources, you know, these hormones, these minerals. Um, and so once you start to retain your semen, you build up a very large supply of hormones. I think it's about after a week or so, some people have done research on this and they find that after about a week of retaining semen, your testosterone levels goes up to about 150% of the normal level. And so, you know, you don't need to be taking testosterone supplements or anything like that when you're retaining semen because you'll naturally have a large supply of this energy. And so this is just a physical manifestation of a more energetic process when you start to build the sexual energy you know this is our life force this is creative energy it's it's a very powerful energy and when you build this energy up as a man you have this enormous supply of energy and it really magnifies every aspect of your being for better or worse you become more of yourself and you also become more polarized so to speak as a male you become more young you become more masculine because you have more of that male essence as you retain your semen and so what happens when your polarity increases well the opposite polarity starts to find starts to become a lot more attractive to you so women you're going to find all of a sudden become very very attracted to you you might i've had the experience where i'm out and about you know and i just walk into a room or something and you know women just kind of turn around and look at me like they can just feel that presence so this becomes a very common thing so it's de definitely a very real thing you know so if you've had trouble attracting partners in the past you know I highly recommend practicing semen retention and you don't have to give up sex or sexual pleasure to retain semen this is what I teach in sexual kung fu is how to separate ejaculation and orgasm for a man so you don't have to give up any sexual activity to have the full benefits of semen retention I feel that this is the most balanced path versus completely uh, suppressing sexuality and sexual activity you know a lot of monks do this and they end up having prostate problems and things like this so you can have the best of both worlds you can be sexually active and retain your semen so and this with so what you will find is you have a lot more a lot more power a lot more influence in the world around you as you're retaining semen and building sexual power and with this comes responsibility of course because yeah. you know you have the power to influence people and um, and I it's you want to use this power wisely you know for the highest interest of ourselves for the world around us so as I mentioned before, sexual energy amplifies everything. And so if you're not emotionally clear, mentally clear, you're going to amplify any, uh, any, any negative emotions you have, any, you know, uh, if you have anger, if you have frustration, 
jealousy, things like this, and you're working with sexual energy, you're just going to amplify these things. So it's important as you're doing sexual work to work with your emotions, to or work with, you know, sort of these shadow aspects of ourselves and bring these into the light to be resolved. Because when you're working with sexual energy in a space of love and a space of balance and joy, it is incredible. You're going to amplify love, amplify joy, and amplify your creative energy to manifest whatever you want. And so sexual energy work is the most powerful work. Sexual energy is the most potent force in the universe. So I hope that you find this video helpful or insightful. Um, I have an Instagram account there where I post various uh, inspirational things and uh, different exercises for sexual energy. So check out my Instagram and I've got some new courses coming on sexual Kung Fu practices and training. So check those out. Stay tuned for that. Uh, please subscribe to my channel, like this video and leave a comment. I always love hearing from you guys. I'm happy to answer any questions you have. So thank you very much. I wish you the best on your path. Have a great day.